each day before the game. They have to limit second chance opportunities for UNH. Pogue along to Money. Pogue at 16 points a game in America East play. That's third in the conference. At the point, it's Haley Robertson from Toronto dishing towards the post player inside Crimble, and she banks it in for two. Bly, the point guard, a transfer from Marist, did not score against UVM on January 16th. Fogarty, the big jumper, and dished it to Pogue. She finishes it off. Live for three. That's good. Five minutes plus. Healy strips it away. On the breakout for the Wildcats. Easy basket. Wildcats first force a turnover and create points out of it. And their game plan, I think, going forward. Katie Lavelle has checked in, a junior from Hicksville, New York. Sydney Smith for three. Two minutes left, first quarter. Simpson's wide open. Buries a three. The key for them to get you know, back into this is to be able to meet the post players early and not let them get that kind of position. Fogarty rattles in a high jumper, the assist to Healy again. Averaging 18 a contest, 10 starts earlier this year. Three ball banked in. Butler weaves off his screen, finds Courtney Wright, and that's a three. Butler in transition. Butler sends it off to the right, and the layup completed by Katie Lavelle. At post. They swing it. Anderson a triple. At this point in the year, we're in the month of February, as Story collects a deuce. Of Mari McGarity, also an assistant on the staff. We were all chatting before the game. It was a nice little moment there. As Poe keeps it up, rattles in a jumper. The Wildcats improve to 20 and four, 10 and one in the America East. It's the most wins in a single season for the seventh year head coach, Maureen McGarity. 20 wins for the Wildcats. They chased them and they got them.